Cat just sent me their latest Android rugged device called the S60. And as is the protocol here on the internet, whenever you get a new piece of technology, you have to unbox it, right? Okay, first up we have the S60 itself, which we'll get to in a minute. Under that we have a pair of headphones, the USB charger, the micro USB cable, and the warranty and quick start guide that people like us just don't read. Which brings us to the phone. The phone itself unsurprisingly resembles the heavy duty equipment CAT is known for. From the metal rounded edges to the carbon fiber looking back and yellow accents, and even the familiar CAT logo on the back, you can tell where its roots lie. Working our way around the device, we have volume buttons on one side, our power button on the other, along with a yellow programmable button, a covered compartment for the headphone jack, micro USB slot, and an SOS button that feels like the button used to launch missiles. On the back, we have the 13 megapixel camera with dual LED flash, but we also have a thermal imaging camera made by FLIR. Besides said thermal camera, the phone's other promoted feature is the fact that it is drop to concrete resistant up to 1.8 meters, military spec certified, and waterproof for up to five meters for 60 minutes. You are very much reminded of this fact when you pull the latch on the back to open the SIM card and micro SD card slot and then close it with a certain oddly satisfying click. On the bottom of the front of the device, we have our three physical buttons for home, back, and multitasking. We have our speaker at the top of the front as well as these small yellow toggles that, one can assume, close the speakers and microphone grills to allow it to reach that five meter depth at the cost, by the way, of muting the phone. Without toggling those, it still will keep its waterproofing, but only to two meters. Underneath all this hardware, the phone is running on Android Marshmallow with an octa-core Snapdragon processor, three gigs of RAM, and 32 gigs of internal storage. And there you go, guys. A uh, quick unboxing and some specs. Full review coming later in a couple of weeks. Uh, gonna take this guy somewhere rugged. See what happens. Uh, if you guys enjoyed this video, though, please thumbs up it or share it. It is greatly appreciated. And if you want more videos like this, please subscribe to the YouTube channel. And as always, Thanks for watching.